so here we're looking at a uh, model of the eye. Uh, again, this is a this is a right eye, so this would be the superior rectus muscle, the medial rectus, and the inferior rectus. If you look on the top here, you can see where the tendon of the superior oblique muscle would be. But the eyeball itself actually has three main layers to it. Okay, we call them tunics. So this would be the 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 sclera or the fibrous tunic is the outside. That's the white of the eye. This goes all the way down to the cornea. Okay. If you look at these layers in here, the next layer in would be the vascular tunic. This is what we call the choroid layer. You can see it becomes very vascular, the posterior side here. Square inch per square inch, the eye is one of the most vascular areas of the body. The next deep layer that we have would be the retinal. Okay, so the retina is kind of like the wallpaper on the inside of the eye. And this is where this is what we call our neural tunic. So this is where our nerve supply is. When we look at the different segments of the eye, there's an anterior segment, there's a posterior segment. So the anterior segment is actually made up of an anterior chamber that goes from the cornea to the iris. The iris is the colored portion of your eye. There's a posterior chamber which goes from your iris to the lens. This is the lens right here. That's the anterior segment. Posterior, and there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's an aqueous humor that flows through there. The posterior segment is filled with a vitreous humor. It has more of a gel-like substance to it, which kind of gives the eye its shape, like the size of a ping pong ball, shape of a ping pong ball as well. Okay. If we look at some of the structures that we have here, you can see the ciliary body, tiny ciliary processes, and all these tiny little zonules. These are suspensory ligaments that hold the lens in place and actually helps to change the shape of the lens as we focus on something that's near or far. Now, on the posterior side, we have the optic nerve running into the eye. The optic nerve actually terminates at the optic disc. That's the blind spot on the inside of your eye. When you look straight back at something, and something that visual access is going straight to the back of the eye, it doesn't actually hit on that optic nerve, the entry point, which is the optic disc. We actually focus at this area right here that you see in yellow. This is called the fovea. This is our, our, our point of, of, of focus when we have an image coming in at our eye.